my dear brothers and sisters, when we listen to him speaking, we know that this man is really a man of God. Because this holy priest, this good man, has lived 94 years of his life, spending his life in priestly ministry. My dear brothers and sisters, a man who has lived such a long life in dedication for the service of God and His people. He lost contact with his family for many, many years from the time then when he was in uh, Rome all the way until when he started his missionary work in Singapore. And because of that, I think also the church became his, his own family. He treats the people as his own. And his brother priests to him are really, really brothers. <laughs> Each time when I come back to the parish since you know, my, my joining the seminary, he would hold my hand like a grandfather would. He would keep asking things, you know, how, how are you and everything. And like a grandfather, interested to hear my stories. And for me, that is the care and concern that I've experienced from Father Potong. And that would be something I cherish in my heart. One day, uh, I happened to be in a church and Father Tong asked me to help him in something. He said he needed me to help him check some English words. And what happened was, he had bought a children's Bible for a child who was going to start primary one. And he wanted to write a few lines as a form of encouragement. He was 80 over years old and it mattered to him. This little boy going to start school mattered to him and he prepared a gift. That was how important ordinary people, little people like you and I meant to him. The apostolate of the Mandarin speaking grew together with his confess. A man who was so zealous, he held various portfolios. As a young priest, he was in charge of the YCS Mandarin speaking. We all know how much he has done for the Chinese apostolate in Singapore how he started the marriage encounter for the Mandarin speaking. He was the chief editor of Hai Sing Pao for many years. He was the one truly moving, motivating our Mandarin speaking parishioners. Dong Sheng Fu, I am the Dong Sheng Fu. I was in the Chinese school. I started to learn it. From Dong Sheng Fu, I saw Jesus. 我跟我太太是在他手上持有的然后我们一起临时一起成家董师傅一直跟着我们从董师傅的身上我看到他是一个牧者就是一个很好的牧人他把耶稣的那个征服把端里面的神品就是托伊斯布瑞真的他生活很
，这是一说了不得。天主，我要说这个。天主，我说什么？我该说，天主，你要我做什么？就是追求天主之一，不是自己想。假设你说天主要我做什么，天主一定有机会呀、啊，就如同让你能够想到这个。这时候你自然啊有个遇到一些困难吧。可是这时候你会想到，天主，你叫我做。你不能不管呢、啊，所以这样的话，我们愿意做天主的事情吗？需要费心费力。耶稣为救我们，实在是加上受多大的苦。He told me of the struggles at times he had, but he said obedience is the way to find the will of God. He was anything but ambitious. He was not working for his glory. He was not concerned about himself. It was not about what he has done, but what the Lord has done for the people and through him. Now, I think back, I just want to thank God. Very good. The Lord called me to do these, do these things. We left our home, our family, and. 把自己献身给这些，呃，青年人做这些事情，使他们能够，呃，幸福快乐，呃，家庭幸福快乐，子女幸福快乐，呃，为我们就是很大的一个，呃，呃，安慰，而且也是给我们，嗯、呃，呃，给我们带来很大的希望，因为他们做父母的很好，他们的子女很好，将来他们再有的家庭也会很好，啊，是能够大家都能够在天主爱下。能够生活，啊，能够处事，啊，能够呃，把这个平安喜乐和其他人能够一些来分享。You know, when people ask me, can you show me some good holy priest? We don't have to look far. He is one, a man who has given his entire life simply for the glory of God, for the service of His people, faithfully, joyfully, without reserving anything. For himself, Saint Paul tells us, "Therefore is your victory; therefore is your sting." Let us thank God for giving us a victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. But the Paul Tong has won victory over sin, over death.